Here's the titration curve where we're titrating 25 milliliters of a weak base and we have the KB value. We're titrating that with hydrobromic acid. So we have a weak base and a strong acid. And we're going to calculate the pH at the same four points that we did for strong acid and strong base titrations. So we have to do some stoichiometry to calculate the volume that it takes to reach equivalence. So just like we did before, you should be able to calculate that this will take 27.5 milliliters of the hydrobromic acid to reach the equivalence point. So that means 5 milliliters before that would be 22.5 milliliters of the titrant and 5 milliliters past equivalence 32.5 milliliters hydrobromic acid. Point A on the titration curve is before we add any titrant at all. So all we have is 0.55 molar weak base. So we've already seen how to calculate that pH, the pH of a weak base. Write the reaction, write out your ice chart, weak base plus water. When you calculate this, you should get a pH of 12.19. So we're starting off basic, like we knew that the pH had to be. When we react the hydrobromic acid, the pH will decrease. And eventually, if we add excess acid, we know that the pH will be definitely acidic.